hello everybody so last time I uploaded a video on how to turn your bootable pen drive back to normal again on Windows and uh, there was a comment on this video asking how to do this on Linux as many people think that uh, once you do it once you make your pen drive bootable uh, it becomes unusable in Linux so here uh, we are going to make our bootable pen drive back to normal again but on Linux and uh, if you want to check the other video which I did on Windows um, I'll be link I'll be linking that video in the description so in this video we are going to do this by graphical method by GUI method uh, there's another video another method how to do this in in terminal but uh, for some reason I am getting an error uh, so in this video I'll be keeping this just GUI so for this uh, we will be needing gparted um, we install gparted uh, use whatever the package manager your uh, distro has uh, mine is uh, lubuntu it has the apt sudo apt install um, gparted and it will gparted is actually v very intuitive very easy um, the command prompt method and the terminal method is actually a bit a uh, little bit lengthier but that ensures um, that your uh, pen drive will be turned back to normal a here the chance is that your distro might not have gparted so that will be a little problem but uh, in my case uh, there is uh, gparted um, why not just uh, launch it by the terminal uh, g parted just type the name of the application and and press enter it will open yes uh, um, password yes g parted started <laughs> uh, it, it rhymed <laughs> um, you select your uh, your disk from here and go to the this one your selected pen drive and uh, just uh, right click it will not show anything all the options has been uh, grayed up um, so for this uh, we have to first unmount the pen drive okay and now uh, just wait um, and now just right click and uh, delete uh, so everything has been deleted and uh, now we now new and um, and create it as a primary partition uh, file system uh, we would like to have it um, uh, x fat if it is not x fat then we can use at least fat 32 so that we can use it on windows as well uh, free space there should not be any free space align and then label give it any name uh, pen drive or whatever you want to give it and uh, add your pen drive is uh, ready just click the yes and make sure you press that ok button if you do not um, then all your uh, work will not be saved no changes will be saved yeah so our pen drive has been turned back to normal and if we go check this on our file manager since we haven't uh, mounted it it did not show and now we've mounted it uh, pen drive is empty